morning everybody. I am here with my friend Jerry and we are at Spray Lakes and it is early. It's 6 20 in the morning. We got an early start. We're the first ones here. Minus 17. Minus 17. That is also true and it was like minus two maybe even zero degrees yesterday so it's quite the jump. It's a lot colder today but uh, I'm excited to get out there and we're gonna try and find about 15 18 feet of water and we'll be chasing whitefish today, also lake trout. So let's get out there and try and catch a bunch of fish, maybe limit out on some white. Yeah. All right, so we got everything strapped up. Hopefully we got enough propane for the day. And uh, we're just gonna be rocking Jerry's otter tent today. I left mine at home. Almost ready to go out into the dark abyss over there. First one's here. Let's see if there's some type of morning bite for these whitefish, if not. We'll uh, wait till it gets light out before they start biting, but even if there's not, maybe a lake trout or two, we'll swim by in the dark. Let's get out there. Whew. A lot of fresh powder to get that uh, sled to. He's just coming down. Ah, luckily we don't have to go too far. There was a ton of snow last night, so lots of fresh powder, making the uh, trek out a lot more difficult. Okay, let's take a look at the depth. See what we're working with. Holy, 42 feet of water. <laughs> we are way too deep. We were looking for 15. Figured we'd better go a little bit further than we think in the dark. There's a mark down there, though, eh? Oh, really? Yeah, probably a lake trout, too. Mm. Ultralight. Perfect. Jerry's hooked up. On the ultralight, probably a whitey, but we're not sure. Hmm. Let's check it out. They're fighting really well, eh? You sure that's not a nice laker? Definitely get ready to scoop it. You want me to scoop it? Nice oh, that's a rocky, nice, what a beauty. Beautiful. What do you got? What do you got? Oh, I'm getting 30. Oh, I just missed them. 30 bites, too. 33. 33. I just missed one while I was watching you measure. Keeper? Yeah, 30. Yeah, 30 centimeters. Are you going to catch one on film ever, or just waiting for the camera to shut off again? Probably the latter. Nice. Nice strategy for a YouTube video. <laughs> Light bite going on. Oh, I have one just charging. Oh, that's that's you. That's cool. Yeah. And just watch that fish come up. What is it? What is it? Is it a premier? A premiere, a nice keeper size premiere too. Beautiful. Nice. Now you're just out of frame, so I can't record you and the hole. So I gotta film the fight and then go down to the fish after. Yeah. yeah. Beauty. Okay, so it's like light out now. We can see that down the hole. Not really well, but definitely got some light. And the school of Rockies just came through, and I smoked one of them. I'm gonna get this transducer out because he's at a weird angle. This is actually one of the smaller ones of the day. I probably let this one go to be honest. So probably just barely 30 and we're getting lots. So I'll let this one go. He will settle down. That is cool. <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't want to hang out. <laughs> Jerry hooked up again. He's got the hot jig on. I've been getting a lot of too. Oh, that wasn't small. Oh, nice! <laughs> That's why it's small. I did not even notice that. I had to look really closely at that. That is perfect. That one's going in the smoker then, I guess, eh? Yeah. Perfect. I almost look like a brookie. <laughs> so cool. Let's uh, take the hook out and we'll get a close-up of them. Beautiful little laker. Into the smoker pile it goes. <laughs> So Jerry's got the hot hook right now. Oh, he's using a, a black tungsten with maggots on it. And a higher bunch up. of glowing Do you have a hook higher features. up or no? There is. There is a hook higher up. A chronomid. A little chronomid. Okay. Perfect. There we go. A better angle. What is that? A laker? You must have foul hooked it or it's a nice size. Still hasn't. Oh, that's a decent fish. A decent rocky. It still hasn't uh, even made it up to the top yet, but 
Oh my gosh, Rocky, that is a beauty. Yeah. It's one of the bigger ones we've caught here, to be honest. Spray PB? It might be. Whoa. That's a beauty. It's probably like 16 inches. Whoa. Oh yeah, look at that. That's one of the nicest ones we've ever got out of spray. It's not fat by no means, but it's like 16. Yeah. Look at a measurement. 15, 15 uh, almost 15 and a half. 15 inches. and a half if you pinch the tail, probably. Beautiful. Yeah. It's a nice one. I think we've got them this size, maybe, but not much bigger. Right. So I switched to the dinner bell and uh, immediately just had one smash it. Thought it was small at first, but now it's starting to feel a little bit better. Oh, no! <gasps> and now it's gone. <laughs> no. well, it's a little bit after nine, and you can see down there really well. It's so awesome when a fish comes through. And uh, we look outside, we got plenty of light. And uh, beautiful mountains. It's a shame to be in the tent, actually, but it's pretty cold out there. We have the lake to ourselves, which is unheard of here. I guess people don't want to brave the cold weather, so we'll enjoy it ourselves. Coming back to yours now. Oh, no, he's back to mine. Oh, I missed him. He come back up. not very big but it messed with me on bottom for a while and I finally got it to eat it. I kept eating it by the tongues and head instead of the... it's starting to feel a little bit bigger actually. It looks small down there but maybe it's not as small as I thought it was. No! <sighs> That one was a keeper for sure. Oh, oh my god. <laughs> At least we got our hooks out though. Yeah, like yeah. combine those with the actual catches. <laughs> we're doing alright. <laughs> no. no! Was it big? It was like 16, 17, maybe even 18 and like chunky. Really? Yes. No. Out of nowhere, eh? Yep. Alright, so it is probably quarter after 11 now. And I think I'm going to start cooking lunch right away because it's a pretty slow bite and I'm getting pretty hungry. Got a pretty special lunch today, but I think we're going to make that a completely different video. So stay tuned for that one. And uh, after that, we'll, we'll get back to fishing and maybe we'll get a few in between while we're cooking too. So be pretty stoked to try out those, those birds. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yes, I am. Someone's a little tired. <laughs> So it's getting close to noon. It's actually fairly nice out right now. It's probably about minus 15, minus 16. And I'm just getting a little bit of fresh air. And uh, I'm going to go back in, try and fill that limit, and cook lunch. The wind's probably terrible, so I'll get back in there. Got <laughs> Nice. No, it looked big. I believe it's a small one. Oh yeah, one of the smallest of the day. Kinda hoping he just pops off. Got batter all over my hands still because he's cooking. <laughs> wow, that's tiny. Let him go. Peace. Okay, so this is probably gonna be the last Rocky of the day that I keep. I caught it on the frostbite dinner bell. And uh, of course it's gonna do that once I record. But yeah, we're gonna keep this one. And uh, oh shit, I got a knot too. No, we're good. Anyways, I'm gonna put it in my pile. I got four Rockies today. I already had one in the freezer. So yeah, that is a nice one to round off my limit. So maybe I'll keep uh, lake trout if I get one, but we're just gonna be releasing Rockies for the rest of the day. I think Jerry's got one left to keep though. Nice. Perfect. <laughs> right on the jerky. Almost four and we're still getting them. Probably like the 10th, 15th Rocky, somewhere in that range of the day. 
it is time to pack up. It's about 4.30 now, and uh, we did pretty good. Jerry got four, uh, four Rocky Mountain Whitefish, sorry, and one lake trout, and I got four Rocky Mountain Whitefish as well. There they are, right there. Beauties. There's that little laker. And over here, more Rockies on my side. Nice. So I think that's going to be a wrap to it. I'll, uh, maybe I'll film packing up the tent. It was a great day out on the ice. And uh, yeah, I'm going to get packing up and we're going to go and get some Chinese food tonight. So can't wait for that. Woo! This hill is always a workout to get up. And it's not even that big of a hill, but it's just at the end of the day. The snow's all sticky. It's all slippery of a hill. Can't complain when you got that view behind you. We'll make it there, right? We'll get some Chinese food. All right, quick stop because we managed to get those people out of the ditch here. <laughs> slid into the ditch and almost like right in the ditch. I say the ditch but really the ditch that they almost went into was right there so <laughs> luckily we were able to pull them out. A uh, little SUV type thing and there wasn't really much to hitch on to but we got it out so yeah let's go get that Chinese food now. <laughs> 